What's up, bikes? I'm Lexi, and you're watching SVTV. Snowball is tomorrow from 8.30 to 10.30 p.m. The variety show has been rescheduled for Tuesday, February 22nd at 7 p.m. in the auditorium. The cost is $5. Juniors, now is the time to apply to possibly be accepted into the college and career internship program. See Schoology for the Google form to fill out if interested, and they are due by midnight on February 25th. See Schoology for more information. Now, on to sports. Friday's theme against Lansing is red carpet. Any student interested in trying out for the cheer team should attend the informational meeting in the Counselor's Cove that has been rescheduled for Monday, February 21st at 1.10. You need to make an appointment pass to Ms. Sands if you plan on attending. There is a baseball informational meeting that has been rescheduled also for Monday, February 21st during CALP. You need to make an appointment pass to Jacob Kermer if you are attending. There is a softball informational meeting on Tuesday, February 22nd during CALP. You need to make an appointment pass to Mr. Monholland if you plan on attending. Gage and Aaron went to learn more about powerlifting. We talked to a couple athletes that participated in the powerlifting meet and here's what they had to say. My performance at the meet was great. I got first in my weight at 140 and um, it can only go up from here. My totals at the meet were 825. I think I can prove on my uh, squat, and uh, it's kind of getting close to my bench, and I, I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, I would 100% join. I think we should do it. I performed pretty well. I took first in my weight at 182. My totals at the powerlifting meet were 895. I think I can improve on my clean. You know, there's some people out here that weigh a lot less clean a little bit more than me, and I don't like that. Uh, yes, I would join uh, very quickly. Well, actually, we did really well. We did. Uh, we got second place. We scored 70 points versus 70. Excuse me. We did. We had 70, and the winning team got 74. So we did really well. The girls placed uh, in the top. I think they got six out of uh, 32 teams with only five girls. So they did really well too. But uh, we 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 had a chance to win. If we would have got five pounds here or there, we probably would have won that meet. There was a whole bunch throughout the year, but most of them are, have come and gone. There is a state uh, powerlifting meet in Pittsburgh, Kansas for 5A. It's really tough to go to now because uh, it's uh, state wrestling, state basketball time, and, and spring sports are starting, so a lot of kids can't go. We've always had a powerlifting, uh, powerlifting team. We just couldn't get kids to go. And we, we decided to do a virtual to see if kids would be interested and, and kind of get a feel and figure out it's not as bad as they thought. So now I'm getting a lot of kids asking if they would, uh, if we had any more. But uh, at this time, we're hoping next year after doing this uh, virtual one that we'll get several kids interested and we can fill a team. That's all I have for today, Vikes. Have a great weekend.